Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And I know there's double money on land races right now. Including the new Keo Perico ones. But I miss my stunt tubes. I was really kind of hoping to drive the, uh, the XO, the new one. Torio, Torero XO. But it looks like we're doing some sports car stuff. Maybe against one guy. Just to say this. Um, the, the crashes have been really annoying as of late. Don't even know if the guy speaks English, but we tried. What do we want to take today? What do we want to, want to take today? Some of these things don't... Uh, you know, why not? It's not going to be the best thing in the world, but it's, it's a thing. I'm wearing this funny suit. I forgot to change clothes. I don't feel like going try hard GTO all the time. I haven't driven this car in a while. I'm basically just going to drive what's pretty kind of boats and everything. We're both in the same... Uh, all right, that that's an interesting mix. I'm not sure how this is going to play out. I'm glad I didn't go goat. This will be this will make it interesting. All right. Jester seems to have the edge in the beginning. I mean, I think there was some kind of deal where if you put low grips on the gesture, it was supposed to take off. But then you wouldn't be able to handle it all. We did that a little gingerly, but... I don't know, maybe he's trying to live with no grips. I think he'd be having more trouble with that. Maybe maybe just something to the car now since the change. So this this could be just straight up about the same speed. Alright, let's do this here, Chester. Ooh! Lost it in the turn. You will have this. Oh, if he was running with low grip tires, he was doing really well. I mean, Or maybe he just likes the Fast and the Furious and thought, hey, this is my my racing car. Will we make the jump? That's always a question. Now there is still just a little matter of the best lap situation. We have to, we want to see if now that he's got clean air, I think he made it two laps. We want to make sure we get we can try for best lap. Again, this is not a try hard choice for this. Definitely, I'm going bold choice here, but so did he. See, it's this one will pop around a little bit, so. No, 
Now, he looks to me close, you know, he's lined back up on me, so I wonder. That really should be an insurmountable amount of track to, to consume, but... Maybe that, maybe that Jester Classic really is, you know, I think. Is this Jester versus Jester? I think it might be. Yeah, it is. So we've got Jester Classic versus the Je How did we even, we didn't even plan that. I just grabbed the pretty red car. Alright, Jester, let's let's see uh let's show them what a new Jester can do, all right? Show them what a new Jester can do. Now I really wish he hadn't slid off. <laughs> well, I will take a W. Wherever I can find it. <coughs> We're not being utterly, you know. Not being McMuffmeister-ish, you know. We don't want to do that. I didn't, he didn't go off because of anything I did. By the way, in, in normal physics, leaning back like that would, cut me, would cause the car to slow down. But because of some of the weird physics in GTA, I'm attempting to get it to glide a bit. It's kind of like it, the gravity is always a little bit perpendicular to the car, so there's some weird physics that goes on with that when you're doing jumps. Yeah, let's see. How does he do it? There you go. Some of the more slightly boosted payouts, but you know, it's. I'm not overly concerned about the slightly boosted payouts. And he had the fastest, best lap by like two seconds. Now, how? He just say GG. And he's out. Cluster struck is the, the next one up. I mean, he slid off. I mean, there's, you know, and there's nothing. <sighs> We're just going to have to play the double money, aren't we? Oh, well. Okay, well, I picked any race. And somehow I ended up in a transform race, which I don't know how you're going from races to stunt race. Well, we're back. All right. Let's see. Customs are on, so we will we get to use our rocket roll tick. So I mean the computer doesn't crash. Again, wouldn't be you know, transforms generally aren't my cup of tea anymore. They're I did them for a long time. Bit uh let's, let's, yeah, let's go to drag. Green mode. Everybody look at the other guy. Went kind of quick. 
Looks like I'm the only custom rocket here, but that doesn't, you know. That was weird. The interest, it's, yeah, blah, the interesting thing, I can talk. It's, it's early on a Monday morning, but I can talk. Right, Monday. Friday morning. Feels like a Monday morning. Ah, it's Friday morning. I've got enough to do today, it's going to feel like a Monday, but. The interesting thing about these uh, these cars is is that I believe the cycle time on the on the stock one is different than the modified one. I think I might have like more of a burn time, but like a longer recycle time, something weird like that. I don't remember what the difference was, but it was a difference. I wonder if that guy was completely disoriented and is just flying upside down because he thinks it's upside right. I don't know. <clears throat> or if he's just doing it for style. You never know. Style could be. Okay, so there's first. Wee! <laughs> okay, let's see if the bike choice helps. I don't have to wheelie. Can just lean forward, which means I can steer. I think he's going to be at 400, which is a really high top speed. And then it doesn't matter because you're into the havoc. And we're right on top of each other. Gain a little altitude here, which you trade a little speed doing that, but not make the checkpoint. Okay, so what do we, we launch into here? Is it back into the Voltic? Probably. Whoa, that really dropped a lot faster than I thought it would. Maybe it dropped a lot faster than he thought it would. Whoa. Well, it's, it's fairly possible that, that that last maneuver was intentional. He could have just been sloppy, but more than likely. And that did cost me a few seconds, so. A critical bumpy McBumpmeister move? I don't know. Because I am running the modified Voltic, I 
I do have a higher top speed when not in a rocket. It's not by much, but. I have to really try to. You see, the, one of the problems with transform races is that there isn't a lot of place to. There's not a lot of room to pick up speed. There's like you can't cut time off the, uh, the lab very easily because it's very structured. It's long enough so that you theoretically could, but like, okay, maybe if I could really cut the inside of this corner. So there he is. That's still the same gap, I think, that he presented me with. I think, you know, it's very possible that that wrecking me at the last minute really, you know, on the last lap really did win it for him. So this is where we have to see if we can get a better line. That should be the finish. This is going to be dang close. <laughs> if he hadn't wrecked me, I would have won. I'm going to call that right now. <laughs> I'll put up a DJ on that. Whee! Mostly this guy, though. I'm not entirely sure that's even all just rocket stuff. I feel like there's more going on here. Because he can't recharge his rocket, I don't think, by touching the ground. This is either some weird form of glitching or just right out modding, I don't know. Which probably means this computer is going to crash at some point. It's entertaining. Gone to space. What's that noise? Okay, finally, <laughs> the, the DNF timer. Yeah, there's something really untoward happening here. Something really weird. It's 
725. Okay, I did get best lap, so roughly special on that one. Look how close it was. Three tenths of a second I pulled that back in. And really, there's only a couple places. I caught a couple of corners really tight with the helicopter. I don't know what we're getting. This guy's just clicking all over the place. I think there might be only a couple of us here. I'm thinking I should go back and try to look for some Keo Perico or something rather. All right, well, we get to do. The customs are still on. That's just down to another duel. I'm the host, huh? All right, single lap shootout. Confirm. And he's got it anyway, so. All right, fine. We're done. For here, let's go try to find another race. You know, well, we got a KO Perico, so at least we'll get a little of that double money action here. They've said it's a super. All right, so we're going to take out our uh, Trio XL just for the heck of it. I don't think that that's going to be the best one for this. Are we loading? Hello? There we go. I think the Krieger is definitely a better choice. Actually, you think the truth, actually, the problem I think is, I think the Autark is probably a really good choice for this. <coughs> Some high grip. It's relatively small. I want to, I'll take the Autark. It's a uh, reload. Because these, these roads are so tight, and, you know, the truth of the matter is... I think I think that the, the XL is going to be all over the place with it. It's, not, it's got good handling, but that's certainly not great. And someone's taking one. And top speed is not going to be useful on this track for the most part. Oh, goodness. This might have been actually a try-hard choice. Look at that thing go, though. Oh, my goodness. It's a... It's a, it's a GTA. Oh, that's bad. Why would you put this in as a GTA race? Oh, spun, spun around on me a little there. Oh, that was pushing a little bit on the dirt. Maybe, maybe this wasn't a good choice for the dirt. I mean, I just have to remember to use brakes. Brakes might be a thing. I am in first. I didn't realize that. I'm not really sure how. But yeah, this supers do not like this. Oh 
man, what would be the best car for this as far as supers? I don't even know. I mean, it's too memorous. It's got the four-wheel drive and all that, but I don't think any of them have like a really good off-wheel, you know, track time loss kind of thing. One of the electric ones, maybe? There's a lot, a lot of acceleration. You get out of the turns. I thought the Autrack would be a pretty good choice. It's not real big. You can sneak around with it. Did everybody else quit? Like, where is... Now they're way behind. And with, with this, I gotta stay way ahead. Because if they can put a missile lock on me, I mean, I'm gonna be doomed. That's your race right there, you know. Oh, this is this is a Somebody said the heck with it, okay. It is painful. I mean it's, this is not a fun race. This is very slow and technical and not really a, a track for supers. Let's just say that. Probably best suited for motorcycles, really. Don't do that. I didn't even hit it that hard. Wow. Come on, that was a lot of lost time. My only hope is that it's happening to those two guys constantly. Oh god. That was a little bump. I, I just I flipped that just a little bit. Come on, Artar, show me what you got. Down and back, all right. This could be problematic. Now we're coming straight at each other and we've got missiles. Please be a one lap shootout. No. There's going to be some overlap here. Unless I'm that far ahead. I'm pretty far ahead. So maybe, just maybe. This is an insurmountable lead. Hello. Well, they don't seem to be playing it like it's a GTA, so I'll give them credit for that. That 811, that's not the car to drive for this, though. It looks like they're both stock cars, so... So they're having their own race, and it seems relatively close. I don't know what's happened to them. Maybe they've wrecked themselves. Come on. I 
I mean, it can't be said that I took like some super high top speed car here. I mean, it's a dog car. But it does have good handling. And I think good brakes. And it's not huge. You have a little more room to work. You're not getting caught on everything. I don't even think the Autark's four-wheel drive, so I don't even have that going for me. This is a long track. Okay, roll over. Roll over, Ubu. Come on, you're giving up the whole lead. Okay, we're stuck. We stuck it. Well, that might make things interesting. I'm just saying, you don't get hung up on stuff, and then I got hung up on stuff. So, commentator's curse. Even so, I still think we're running a fairly insurmountable lead, but... Wanted to get a turbo, one turbo boost out of this. And I think best lap assured. Man, it's a long race. Feels long. Yeah, that that car does not want to, that's not gonna want to turn. That car's only strength is top speed. You can't wind it out on these roads. Let's let's watch the uh, the Toriador here, the Toriero. The other T word. There you go. Yeah, it's, that's what I was afraid of with this thing. It'd be popping all over the slide and all over the place. And you're losing your spoiler in the corners. Yeah, this, this race was hell for these guys. I mean, it's not a bad stock choice because you get the spoiler. Sometimes. But this whole track is low speed corners. Interesting choice. This guy has a chance. Snipe him from behind. No, oh, they're they're playing. They, they must be they must be friends or something. I finished first. I did. That's what happened. Eight forty eight. Thirty two thousand. All right. Well, there's some money.
clickety clack. That was so painful, though. I don't know if the Cayo Perico races are going to have any kind of long-term steam on them, because they're interesting and they're different. You get to go to the island, and I'll back you up on that. And I can see doing loading one up in just a, 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 a single-player, you know, a solo GTA race, and it's getting out of the car and looking around. Really familiarizing yourself with the map. Now, I know most people who do Caraparico every day, every single day of their life, well, they're not going to need that, but. That's not something I do. Muscle, coupes, SUVs, no sedans. Tuner, motorcycles. Sports, really? Okay. Do I really hurt them? There's a couple different ways you can really hurt them here. I mean, obviously, it's the uh, sport. This is one way. The Custom Comet Safari might be an interesting choice on this. Sterling GT might be an interesting one, too. I don't know if they're going stock cars here. They're new guys, so we'll take the Sterling. They need some wins. Okay, not a bad choice either. Is this the same one over again? See, they're going to have top end on the great pile, so I'm in a sports classic. I feel like I need to give one of them the win. Because they need, like, paint and things. Well, that might do it. Oh, dear. I'm not intentionally doing that, by the way. It's just happening. Okay, so we'll let you get ahead. Let's at least make it a little interesting. Yeah, this isn't a, this wasn't a bad choice. Certainly not the OP choice. Don't forget, I'm not. I'm on PCs, and we don't have HSW yet, so this isn't like some ridiculous. You know, though, if this was the GTA version of it, I, I couldn't be shut out because of the glitch that's going on right now. Um. Okay, he just went swimming. Oh, 
<laughs> Almost. I think he recovered it. Okay, so this is a different race. It's just wildly similar. Ow! I can't even be 100% sure that was intentional. <laughs> See? He's just yeeting himself about. So it's definitely, you know, all these tracks are gold slow to go fast kind of tracks, you know? There's not a lot of high speed stuff in them. It's just driving around. Trying to, I mean, it makes it much more technical. I mean, where you, uh, where you can find speed, if you, you know, becomes the thing. And if one person can find more speed than somebody else, even when you're having to really use a lot of brakes, lift a lot. And now I'm my turn to go off. I should love catch up. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. He, he needs some wins. I'll just end it for the other guy. There is still that mechanic where you, can't un you have to unlock speed parts and stuff by getting wins. Next time, we'll, we'll, what we'll do is we'll go with a, a non-custom car. And then pretty much wrap it up, I think. So if that's custom, then they're really, really picking boring cars. Of course, see that. that's an interesting thing. Alright, what are they gonna pick? You guys pick, I'm going I'm going with a rental. Like and subscribe. I won't even go BF400. And after this, I should probably like water the yard or something. Yeah, it might be too late in the day for that now, too. It's like almost 10. Or after 10, something like that. We're going to go a Manchester Scout.
which is not a bad choice. It does have like ridiculous wheelie capabilities, but can't really do that here. So Miracle Maker K. I oh, mean, Miracle Maker K is gonna win this one. Who knows? They're both in 400, so they know it's going. They know what ends up, I guess. Maybe they watch the brush. Ugh, let's try and keep this a little interesting. Oof. Oof. Then we're all dead. Well, I'm the least dead, and I'm in the first. Okay. Elos, I'm not wheeling. I'm just... Oh, here, I'll wheelie wheel on this long stretch. But I don't know that the, I don't know on this on these courses whether the bike matters all that much because you can't wind it up as much. Ooh, I think I think I did that to myself. I think I overwheeled it there. I hit a bump. It'd be funny if this is the one time they're both using customs. That'd be funny, but still. Two and two. I'm pretty far behind, actually. That uh, that crash took me out of a lot of it. So she can just race clean. Well, maybe not. <laughs> That's where I fell off before. She picked up a good amount of speed through there, though. That was nice. And into the bushes. Lift to there a little bit so you don't launch yourself into space. Uh, now, you know what? You guys can have it. There you go. We'll take a second. And this is a GG, guys. Gotta go. I gotta cut these guys some slack. Let them do some racing on their own. Not a lot of money for second there, that's... Come on, let me say GG guys, gotta go. Yes. We'll give it a like. Let those guys get some, some wins. You gotta unlock so many things in this game if you wanna upgrade your cars. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.